In this week's episode, condom fishing in Cuba, numbats make a comeback, using infrared to fight poaching in Kenya, and a snake in the toilet. Starting off in Australia, where the Perth Zoo is on a mission to save some very adorable little marsupials. Fitted with radio tracking collars, 14 captive bred numbats will be released into a predator-free wildlife sanctuary. Occupying just 1% of their original range, numbats are now a critically endangered species, and it's hoped that this move will see their numbers recover. Staying down under with the Great Barrier Reef's mass spawning event. Once a year, almost all the corals on the famous reef mass reproduce at around the same time to increase chances of fertilization. During spawning, coral polyps release tiny egg and sperm into the water. Amazingly, the Great Barrier Reef Marine Park Authority is able to predict the timing of this spawning down to the half hour using water temperature and tides. On to this courageous little reptile. Rescued off Cape Cod, the green turtle is being hailed as a biological miracle after it was discovered that the animal had traveled thousands of miles with only one lung. Besides a missing lung and a bout of hypothermia, the turtle is recovering well and will be released back into the wild. Off to Africa, where wildlife rangers are using infrared cameras, artificial intelligence, and drones to stop illegal poaching. The WWF has started deploying thermal sensing infrared technology in Kenya's Maasai Mara Conservancy Park as a tool to protect endangered species. Since the program started, rangers have nabbed 26 poachers and the project is soon to be expanded into Malawi and Zimbabwe. Fishermen in Cuba are using inflated condoms to catch fish and it's proving surprisingly successful. Dubbed balloon fishing, the process involves blowing up a condom and attaching it to a fishing line as a float. The innovative method allows fishermen to reel in fish from hundreds of feet off the coast, replacing more dangerous techniques like cork fishing. Off to California's Lake Shasta, where a pair of swimming mountain lions were caught on camera. It might seem strange to see cougars in the water, but the big cats are actually great swimmers and will often swim in search of prey. The felines are also known to hunt sea animals such as otters and seals. Rounding off with this eight foot snouted cobra found hiding in an apartment toilet in South Africa. A snake catcher was called to assist, but despite his best efforts, the slithery creature made a quick getaway, straight back into the building's drainage system. That's it for today. We wanna to hear your opinions on these nature news stories. Tell us what you think in the comments below.